middle, giant boxing. Right, and lastly, uh, who, who should Canelo fight next? Obviously, it hasn't been announced yet. They're, they're throwing out Mukia. I like Benavides. I like Mukia. Okay. Like if I were to be in that position as a, as a fan, I say Mukia or Benavides. As a promoter, as Canelo's promoter, I say Mukia. Yeah. Why Mukia? He's a younger fighter. He's strong, but he's younger. He's a little inexperienced. So get him now before you get him later. You know, because you get him a little too late. You know, the fight's gonna be more difficult. He's only gonna get better. Is what you're saying? Yeah. Exactly. Well, he's only getting better. And even after you lose that fight, he's not gonna. He doesn't really lose anything, right? He's only gonna get bigger. He's gonna gain the experience. He's gonna get a, get get a big paycheck. And yeah, that, that's how I see it. And he's gonna become a lot better in the future. So can I should get him now? Right. I, I mean, words. I was trying to get a fight with Mookie in the past. I remember that. That would have been a 154 war. 154 where? Yeah, 154. You yeah. still flirt with that idea or no? Uh, well, right now I'm out of the game. I'm out of the game now. But um, yeah, Mookie, he has a bright future ahead of him. He's a good fighter. He has a good promoter behind him. Did you see improvements him. in his last fight with Freddie Rose? Very much. What did you see? I saw a stronger fighter. I saw a fighter that can manage his distance a little bit better. I saw volume punches. Volume punches. Yeah, he, he was able to combine them together. He was... Um, yeah, he calculated his distance well. That way, he was able to land his punches properly. Mm -hmm. And which you land them at the perfect distance, they come in a lot stronger. Mm -hmm. That's what he did. What up? What up? What up? What up? Pero y el y el Hector? ¿Qué tal el Hector? ¿Qué tal el Hector? Ahí está. ¿Qué tal el Hector? Ya listo. Medio, medio, medio. All right, Jesse, any, anything you want to leave us with before we let you go? Oh, thank you for the support. Thank you for remind following us again the little about giant. That. Remind us again about the address. Yeah, 4220 Pico Boulevard, the Green Cafe. It's a great restaurant, great food. Quality, it's a vegan said, restaurant, right? yeah, but it's a Mexican vegan restaurant. It's quality. <laughs> the food tastes just like meat. If you're not a vegan lover, the, the food just tastes exactly like meat, and they have great uh, desserts as well. They have some good stuff, I'm telling y'all. This is my favorite vegan restaurant. Every time I come to LA, I stop by the Grand Cafe. So come out and then you get to see the mural, take a picture with it. And yeah, man, we're just happy to be here.